So there is this website called Displate that basically prints uh, pictures, covers into uh, a plate, metal plate. So you can put it behind you, you can film and stuff like that, right? It's very nice. So I heard about that from different YouTube videos. Uh, I was interested. So I went to display.com, hit enter, and first thing that came to my mind, I wanted to search for Kinshi. I wanted the Samurai X uh, display. So I found a few. I didn't buy any. And then I closed the site. The next thing I went to my Instagram, and I've been bombarded with the same pictures, displays, ads, with the same pictures that I picked from the site in Instagram stories and, and pictures and, and the ads right, that, that show up. So I was wondering how did display communicate with Instagram to transfer that knowledge? Obviously, I was surprised, but you shouldn't be surprised these days. But I'm interested from the technical perspective because this is a tech channel. This is a software engineering channel. So how about we discuss what I think happened? So when I went to display.com, I was logged into Facebook because it's my own machine. And I didn't open this in an in incognito window or anything like that. So I was logged in to Facebook. So I had a cookie with Facebook. That was my theory. If I went to display.com, I believe what happened here. Displayed had a request to Facebook ads. This is, in this case, a third party domain to send whatever I searched to Facebook as a request. So the display, they don't know who I am because I didn't log into display. They don't know anything about me. That request says, hey, someone just searched Kinshin on display, Facebook, and that just sends that request magically. Display technically do not know who I am, and I think they still don't unless Facebook can, uh, communicate that information back. So now, when, I, when they send that request to Facebook, as a get request or as a pull request, doesn't matter. If I had a cookie with Facebook.com, and that cookie is set property same site equal none, that request from display as a major site to Facebook.com will be sent that cookie that identifies me will be actually sent to Facebook alongside the information that said oh someone just uh, searched Kinshin on 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 display so now Facebook knows that me Hussein actually searched for Kinshin actually on display so he is interested in 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 this anime so now they just know the knowledge very simple now let's just bombard them uh, <laughs> with ads so they can serve me ads in, in Instagram they can first me back because Instagram owns by Facebook right they can serve me ad there they can serve me ad on Facebook themselves so they can serve me ads everywhere because they know that they got the knowledge that I am interested in this not only search Koji I actually interested in this particular one the one I clicked in because that's the one that gets bombarded uh, to me on Instagram stories. The, the same one I actually clicked, there were like thousands of them, but the one that I actually clicked on got recommended. So now my, my thoughts is now, does actually does display the website know me? Well, if I visit them again, they probably do because they they stored it in their lo in my local storage on browser. But if I went as an incognito, they definitely don't. Because I don't believe Facebook will communicate this information back to 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 display it. Otherwise, it will be breach of privacy. I don't think we have privacy anymore, but sure. But yeah, I don't think they will share my name with display. That will be bad. I don't think that information is communicated back. But I think Facebook will tell us, hey, Rishta, sure, display that we're going to target your beautiful customers 
in a very micro manner. That's going to be, it is sneaky, I got to admit, but as software engineers, you got to admit that's a little bit smart. The technical part of it, I don't condone the, the whole tracking or things like that, but that's the world we live in. What do you guys think about this? Did I miss anything? Did you think there is another loophole that, uh, that, uh, that Facebook found what I'm interested in? Let me know in the comment section below. I'm going to see you in the next one. Bye.